everybody off the cuff so far. That's right, right so on the spot. It can't be planned, it's directly there. That's it, you're on I'm the spot. I'm zooming in. Yeah, it's running. <laughs> it started, yeah, it's running. Welcome, welcome everybody to Charlie Company. We're here in sunny Adabalat, or Adabai on the map. It's on the sort of northwest coast. We're actually up in the Batan rear at the moment, so everybody's laughing at us because we're uh, we're the surf uh, company at the moment. So Charlie does surf, but all the guys have had a good time. They've got a bit fitter, uh, had a bit more relaxed, and we pop down under the border in about five or six days, which should be good fun. But everyone's working hard. I'd just like to say hello to Justine and the kids uh, back in Australia. What can I tell you about Charlie Company and what we've been doing? We've had a number of very exciting instances whilst we've been here in uh, Ida Balatin. I think the most notable one I'd say was uh, Corporal Travis out at our permanent vehicle control point stopping a vehicle that uh, was doing in excess of uh, 80, or, 80 or so kilometres and he had to raise his rifle. On stopping the vehicle he moved to the driver's side, looked at the driver and suddenly saw behind the driver the passenger was in fact a nun. Corporal Travis, being the diplomatic sort, said, excuse me, nun, do you speak English? She said, no. He then immediately grabbed the driver and said, right, are you, and I won't repeat what he actually said from then on in, <laughs> pulled the driver out and uh, ordered the driver to leave his vehicle and return to Likasar, which is about, well, it took him about six hours to come back with his boss. Um, what he did then subsequently is he grabbed the nun out of the vehicle and said, right, oh, nun, I'll get you to lift to Balibo, pulled up the next vehicle, Grab the driver of that said, right, see this nun? I know your name, I know her name. If you touch a hair on this nun's head, I'll something else. <laughs> so that's a sort of, uh, that's a sort of uh, company we are. We've been looking after people. Um, we've also, uh, your cameraman is just behind the camera there, Corporal Grant and uh, Private Tri spent a night looking after a lady who just had the birth of uh, a child and the placenta remained in that. And uh, we're uh, very relieved to have that lady survive and aero medevac to, um, to Dilly, but uh, and also lucky as they ran to the aircraft, the helicopter to find Steve Liebman and the Today Show filming all of their actions. So hopefully you saw that on, on television. Same and that's I think our uh, second birth we've had in the last two months we've assisted in. Yeah. One one was also down at Maliana, which is which is good. But the company is is, is well, and uh, it's a pity we didn't go on that first video. But Charlie Company featured a lot in the in the one that you saw back in January. So that's fair enough. Go to the other companies a bit of a bit of an opportunity. But hopefully all the guys are living know exactly what's uh, what's going on. And hopefully getting good information on when we're uh, when we're coming home. If do if you do, let us know because we'd appreciate it as well. What about uh, say hello to everybody, Don? Hello everybody. All right, it's pretty uh, comfy. Won't go into that. Because of the shortage of helmets, old Don's made his own. One of the medieval knights in shiny armour. A chain mail. Quaff, what is this? Yeah, quaff. A quaff. That's a quaff for everybody back home. Finn Fry's residence, there's Damo. Say hello to everybody, Damo. G'day. Say g'day. That's what he, Damo's doing what he does best, rest. <laughs> uh, that's looking a million dollars. Finn Fry's residence, there's Damo. Say hello to everybody, Damo. G'day. Say g'day. That's what he, Damo's doing what he does best, rest. <laughs> uh, that's looking a million dollars. Say hello to everybody. Say hello to the missus. Hey, Michelle. Uh, you want to say any guest? Yeah, no. Nah. Go on. Not really. No. He's trying to quit, but he can't. Look at him, yeah. darb it up. What can I say, eh? Yeah, like that. Straight into it. What can I say? It's all too much Too much work to be done. He's looking fit. It's figure of fitness here, Tony. Figure of fitness. That's right. Getting ready for discharge. That's Loving it. it. Have a drag. That's a boy. And zero, zero, this is three. Aladdin, clear over. Oh, look at that. Poetry in motion. That's it. Natural. That's Natural shit. The UN. It's all right. Oh, good. It's good. It's alright. Does the thing. Does the thing? Yeah. You've had enough over here or are you looking forward to getting home? I'm looking forward to leave. Leave? Three When's weeks. that? Three weeks. Three weeks time. Yeah. Cool. It'll sneak up pretty quick. Yeah. <laughs> I hope so. What are you going to get up to and leave? Not much. Just going to go sleep. Sleep? Yeah, I'm looking forward to a bed, man. Really? Yeah. I miss my bed. <laughs> oh, yeah. What else you miss? Just everything. Yeah. Hot water. Hot water? Yeah. We used to have hot water. Yeah, until Jenny correct. Oh, well, yeah. You get that. Hot days, cold water. That's a good mix. Yeah. Not a cold day, only cold water. Yeah, no, well. It could be freezing. Yeah. So, Sarge? Well, I can't really. She's in uh, Dilly. Earning the good money. Really? Yeah. Oh, well. You can show her when, you get, when she gets back. <laughs> yeah, you should be able to do that, I suppose. Does anybody else want to say hello back in Darwin? Uh, yeah, well, uh, 
Sue Wilson. Sue Wilson. Oh, well, that's good. How are you liking your time over here? That was excellent. It's good fun. Best training we've ever done. Well worth it. That's all right. How are you going, Sperm? Good. That's a great answer. Want to say hello to the missus? Hello, Tracy. Yeah, okay, I can expect it. What else? How about hello, how about young one? Say hello. Hello, Amy. Oh, that's great. How are you enjoying your time over here? I'm not. You're not? No. What do you miss? Home. What things about home do you miss that, you, that um, you can't have over here? Family. Well, that's fair enough. I think you're not the only one in that boat, but you look for, so I suppose you'd be on countdown as well. How many days left? Too many. Too many? You got a date when you're getting home? No. No dates? It sucks, doesn't it? Maybe the wives would be able to tell us. Yes. So, Sperm, what's the first thing you want to do when you get home? Have a beer. So, <laughs> I was, I'm glad you answered that like that. What else? Excluding the obvious. Yes. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty full at the moment. Full? Yes. <laughs> I'm trying to keep the, the camera still, but good answer. I can live with that one. So, Sperm, what's the first thing you want to do when you get home? Have a beer. So, <laughs> I was, I'm glad you answered that like that. What else? Excluding the obvious. Yes. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty full at the moment. Full? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to keep the, the camera still, but good answer. I can live with that one. And 500 against Drewy, I'm up $310. Can't see no money. That's all I owe you. All I owe you. Where are you, Drewy? What's, what's happening? You looking forward to getting home? Yeah, not looking forward to paying judge, though. So, Sperm, what's the first thing you want to do when you get home? Have a <laughs> I was, I'm glad you answered that like that. What else? Excluding the obvious? Yes. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty full at the moment. Full? Yes. <laughs> I'm trying to keep the, the camera still, but good answer. I can live with that one. And 500 against Drewy, I'm up $310. Can't see no money. That's all I owe you. <laughs> Where are you, Drew? What's, that, what's happening? You looking forward to getting home? Yeah, not looking forward to paying judge, though. What do you reckon, John? Can say hello to anybody back, back in Australia? Yeah, I'd just like to say hello to Jody. Jody? Who's Jody? Jody's my girlfriend, wasn't he? Oh, righty, eh? Yeah, like and what? Home soon? Really? When? Uh, have, you got, have they given you a date? No, no. She'll probably be able to tell you before anybody else. Nah, mate, she's not in Darwin. Where about she? She's in Perth. Oh, well, good on her. G'day, Sarge. We miss us back home. I'd just like to say hello to Darwin. Yes. Uh, hope yeah. you're doing well, Emily. Hope the cat's... Well, I hope he's not dead. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> whether I mean that or not, yeah. But, uh, no, I hope you're doing well, sweetheart, and I miss you a lot. And uh, when we get home, we'll uh, certainly be looking forward to a lot of fun together. OK, what are you, what's your plans for holidays? Holidays, uh, back to Adelaide for a while, and uh, just plenty of relaxing. Plenty Good of on relaxing. you. Done his weights, yeah, he gives a flex. Go and do another one. Hey babe, how are you? Finally got on. I must say, can't wait to get home. Yeah. Love you heaps. Miss you heaps. And I'll see you soon. All the parking all the time. You're a show, okay. Um, keeping business with a couple of customers. Uh, this is for the, your missus, mate. Is it for my missus? <laughs> What's my missus' name? Oh! <laughs> we'll edit that out, hang on. Yeah, we'll start again. We'll start Here again. you go. We'll I'll cut that out. Is this for the, is this for the baton? Come, yeah. come to the video. I'll come to the video. We're on? We're on? Yep. Yeah, g'day, Nat. It's your lovely husband, Matt, me. Uh, missing you a lot. Can't wait to get home. Um, You're a fool. Yeah, um, we'll have a few beers when I get home. Oh, I will. And, uh, yeah, Grands and pancakes. I hope I'm looking fight and fit, as, as per usual. Have a look at that. And, a big uh, fella. He's not a big fella anymore, he's trim. Yeah, fight and fit, and uh, I'll be right, I think, for a bit of bedroom Olympics week. He's losing weight. No worries. So pat the cats for me as well, will ya? G'day, Rusty, Smokey and Poopy. Poopy? <laughs> Poopy. What's who you want to say hello to back in Australia? 
Oh, I'd say g'day to all my family back at home, mum and dad, brothers, sisters. Excellent. Um, yeah, we just got back from an eight day trip, eight day humping over the Royal Hills and stuff. Haven't had a shower in eight days, so I stink like a bastard. I know, I got my fingers on my nose. <laughs> oh, no, it's good to be back <laughs> and here. And there's boys. a fly buzzing around your head. Well, there's about 30, 40 bloody envelopes, parcels, and all that. He's just been away for two days, that's been. Well, that's what happens when you're the most popular bloke in town. <laughs> Do you want to say hello to anybody back in Australia? Yeah, I've got to say good day to my uh, wife, Nicole. Happy birthday for uh, yesterday, darling. Sorry yeah. to get your ring out, but uh, there was no telephones in the trees where I was. Yeah. Um, got to go to West Timor yesterday, so. Oh, excellent. Another country I've been to. <laughs> but I love, love you heaps, darling, and I'll see you in 40, 41 days when I come home and leave. Well, well there's about 30, 40 bloody envelopes, parcels, and all that. He's just been away for two days, that's been. Well, that's what happens when you're the most popular bloke in town. <laughs> Do you want to say hello to anybody back in Australia? Yeah, I've got to say good day to my uh, wife, Nicole. Happy birthday for uh, yesterday, darling. Sorry yeah. to get your ring out, but uh, there was no telephones in the trees where I was. Yeah. Um, I've got to go to West Timor yesterday, so. Oh, excellent. Another country I've been to. <laughs> but I love, love your heaps, darling, and I'll see you in 40, 41 days when I come home and leave. Hello. Hey, Tanner. Hello, how are you? What, what are you going to do when you get back to Australia? Drink a lot of alcohol and sleep a lot. Sleep a lot? What are you doing that now, eh? No. <laughs> what else? What's your, what's your plans for leave? My plans? Just go home and... Uh, I don't know, going on holidays somewhere, overseas or somewhere. Looking forward to it? Oh, you know. How you going? Look at that. Working hard. Seven months. <laughs> the bloody five months he, he's laid there. Doing Oz, doing Oz prayer. Bed sores on his back, it's bed sores. <laughs> Mail, there's about 30, 40 bloody envelopes, parcels and all that. He's just been away for two days, that's been. Well, that's what happens when you're the most popular bloke in town. <laughs> Do you want to say hello to anybody back in Australia? Yeah, I've got to say good day to my uh, wife, Nicole. Happy birthday for uh, yesterday, darling. Sorry yeah. to get your ring out, but uh, there was no telephones in the trees where I was. Um, got to go to West Timor yesterday, so. Oh, excellent. Another country I've been to. <laughs> but I love, love your heaps, darling, and I'll see you in 40, 41 days when I come home and leave. Hey, Tanner. Hello, how are you? What, what are you going to do when you get back to Australia? Drink a lot of alcohol. <laughs> And sleep a lot. Sleep a lot? What are you doing that now, eh? No. <laughs> what else? What's your, what's your plans for leave? My plans? Just go home and uh, I don't know, go on holidays somewhere, overseas or yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Looking forward to it? Oh, you know. You know. How are you going? Look at that. Working hard. Seven months. <laughs> the bloody five months he, he's laid there. Doing Oz, doing Oz prayer. Bed sores on his back, it's bed sores. <laughs> hey, who do you want to say hello to back, back in Oz? There isn't really no one in Australia who well, last week, Tim. Oh, well, <laughs> say hello to anybody. Say hello to anybody watching. Yeah, uh, there you go, John. Say hello to the Prime Minister. He's good mate of mine. Good on you. That sent me over here to this place. I'll be seeing you soon in a couple of months. <laughs> good day. What are you going to do? do? What are you going to do when you get back? What's the first thing on the agenda? Go get drunk. Good day. What are you going to do? What are you going to do when you get back? What's the first thing on the agenda? Go get drunk. To me. You never sh short of a word. Nothing, mate. I'm going to relax and do absolutely bugger all. <laughs> Go searching for your ash bag. Yeah, uh, hopefully it's going to turn up. I've got tabs on it turning up. Hopefully, if it doesn't, <laughs> we've we got bets happening. Yeah. What's on the cards? What's on the cards for leave? Well. I'm not flying Qantas <laughs> on a book it through handset. <laughs> and I'm considering a terrorist act against Qantas if my bag is returned. Hey Donna, how are you beautiful? Love you very much. Sorry I can't be there. Oh, spewing. <laughs> hey Donna, how are you beautiful? Love you very much. Sorry I can't be there. Oh, spewing. <laughs> That's good mate. What are you gonna, what's the plans when you when you go and leave? Um, have a good time. Yeah, Get away, you, relax. What are you gonna do? What what do you miss the most? What do I miss the most? Yeah. Probably the relaxation. Yeah. Um, beaches with waves. What are you going? What's the least thing? What, what are you going to? Uh, what's the least thing you're going to miss about this place? This uniform. Yeah. <laughs> when? Oh, you're getting out, aren't you? Yeah. When do you get out? Uh, August. August. A little bit of time left. Mm -hmm. That's Bill Wealth. Costello and Dimmit. Oh, look at this. They're both are. They're both in the. So what's what's the plans when you get back? Oh. Rob the bank. Costello's going to open a brothel. <laughs> <laughs> Building wealth. Building up something. Just remember, 90% of the world's millionaires have become wealthy through investment property. Just remember that. That's very deep.
So what are you going to do when you're back? <laughs> I'll blow it on the face. Scared of getting off in his WRA. Just remember, John. Aren't you trying the WRX and we'll get back? Nah, no, mate. You'll never get wealthy by making yourself look rich. Fuck <laughs> <Nah. laughs> me. I remember you were so happy that night preaching that shit, the next morning you had a fucking trip. What do you do when you get back, Murray? What's, what's first on the agenda? Have a two month holiday after two and a half weeks of crap we do when you get back. What are you gonna, where are you going? Uh, down to Moosa Heads, Brisbane, New Rail. The Moosa sounds right, eh? Mm. Stay, stay, going stay to Moosa. cousin's place. Yeah. What about, what else? Any other plans? Anybody you want to say hello to? Just WRX. You missed the car. <laughs> yeah, missed the car. <laughs> missed the car. Yeah. Just Needs a wash. So, what do you reckon you're worth? Oh, prices. Priceless. Priceless. Yeah, so do I. Everybody's priceless. Wait, have, have a look at this bike here. Have a look at this young bike in here. Which one? Matty Travis. G'day. I want to get have a look at me. How, how can you put Give it? Give us a flex, big fella. Suck the gut in. Oh, fucking huge. Huge. Travis, you said suck the guts in, mate. How, how can you be? A, how can you put a price on that? Get away. Hey, do you want to say hello to Mrs? Hello. Um, what's your missus? <laughs> It's a company video, you oh, goose. Rewind that. Rewind all that. I'll cut it. Let's okay. <laughs> see who we can find. Hey! Here's Wixie! Say hello to everybody, Wixie! Hello, everybody. What's going on? Hey, on. I'll pick them too. Love four. Love four. Beauty. But uh, the storm, they will be back. The storm, we get a close up of that. Yeah, they will be back. They will be back. They 4 0 in the series at the moment. Yeah, they are the premiers and they will be back. Uh, back in uh, back in Australia. Um, are we going to Darwin or? Are we oh, going we're going to Darwin. We're going, we're going to Darwin. We're going to Darwin. We're going anywhere. I want to say good day to all the boys in the battalion. Yep. And my thoughts are with you. I know where you're all coming from. When you get back, what's it? What's on? Oh, what's no, number Canada. one on the agenda? Going over Canada. Canada. Mm. Yeah. What are you going to get up to in Canada? Uh, Catch up with some of my rallies and catch up with my sister. Good, yeah. Mm. Do you ski? Oh, I ski a few times over there, so I just ski. Okay. Yeah. So, so. Having a wee in the pisser. Look at him. Say hello, Pete. Good on ya. A couple of days patrol, or be about a week, wouldn't it? Yeah, eight days. Working hard. Who do you want to say hello to back in Australia? I say hello to my wife and my mum and dad. Good on you, mate. What else? Is there any? What's your plans, mate? What are you, you had enough here, or are you keen to stay, or? Well, I'm not that keen to stay. I'd like to stay in the army, but yeah, army's the way. I fucking can stay as what I want to be, and not in fucking this shit job. Well, fair enough, mate. <laughs> if you don't like it, you know. But anyway, what's the plans when you get back? Good, thanks for asking. Working hard, mate. Going oh, the flat out. Rainy element. Flat out, I am. Want to say hello to the missus? Hey, missus, how you going? To your missus. <laughs> You geese. Good day, Lara. <laughs> you are about the fourth person to do that. Well, I'm a bit worried. Obviously, you don't state it correctly. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a bit worried, mate. I don't know who my missus knows now. <laughs> Good day, sweetie. How you going? What you, what's the plans, mate? Have you had enough of being over here? Or? I've had enough. I want to get back home. Yeah, what, what do you hate about being over here? Mate, I hate the politics, you could say. Politics? There's no, there's no, pol there's no political system set up here yet, mate. Exactly, well, that's what people. It's just like a, <laughs> what do you call it, a uh, ring, ring circus or ring politics or whatever. A circus, a circus. That's the way. What do you like about Timor? Oh, uh, so the only thing, the only thing holding me is the money. Money. That's about it. Money ra rules the, uh, the way. There must be something that you like about Timor. Ah, uh, thanks. The homecoming, put it that way. The homecoming, fair enough. The team all what's the plans when you get back, mate? Mate, we're going to get married. Get married? Yep. And what's the date? She knows, doesn't she? She does indeed. Yeah. So what date is August it? August the 12th. August the 12th. Whereabouts? In Sydney. Sydney? Yeah, Lara's doing all the work. She's she's prepared, she's got the place set up for us. Her friends, everything sounds really good. Good on you. Sarge Naylor, Gary Naylor, grumpy Mech sergeant, oh, we better not say mech, I should say uh, tech, sergeant. tech sergeant. Do you want to say hello to Mrs? Hello, Sarah. Hello to the children, Daniel and Jessica. Oh, that's good. What else? There must be something. How about this place? You like it? It's different. Different. Yeah, very different. Yeah, it that's is, isn't right, it? What about, what things do you like about the place? Uh, the people, the atmosphere, um, driving down the road. Although you get the shits with it occasionally, having to wave at everybody, but they run from 
50 metres away because they hit the car and the kids and everything else, they run at you and wave. Yeah, and one of the other up. blokes said that one of the highlights was the, the children. Yeah. I think pretty much the same. They, you never see an unhappy child. No, they got a Even smile if that goes from year to year and they're just happy to see you. It doesn't matter how many times you drive down the road. Yeah. You can do it 20 times in one day, they'll still run at your car and wave and smile right. at you. Holidays, any holidays planned? Don't know yet. Yeah, so, yeah. See what happens when we go back. Might go away, especially July. Kids have got the month off school. So yeah, go good time somewhere. to party on. Party on, yeah. Throw the kids away somewhere and <laughs> go to Bali for four Bali. days. Bali? <laughs> go to Bali? Yeah, yeah. I might go just to annoy them. <laughs> just hang around, bring the kids. <laughs> uh, Sarge Naylor, Gary Naylor, grumpy mech sergeant. Oh, we not say mech, I should say uh, tech sergeant. Tech sergeant. Do you want to say hello to Mrs? Hello, Sarah. Hello to the children, Daniel and Jessica. Oh, that's good. What else? There must be something. How about this place? You like it? It's different. Different. Yeah, very different. Yeah, it that's is, isn't right, it? What about, what things do you like about the place? Uh, the people, the atmosphere. Uh, driving down the road. Although you get the shits with it occasionally, having to wave at everybody, but they run from... 50 metres away because they hit the car and the kids and everything else, they run at you and wave. Yeah, and one of the up. other blokes said that one of the highlights was the, the children. Yeah. I think pretty much the same. They, You never see an unhappy child. No, they got a Even smile if that goes from year to year and they're just happy to see you. It doesn't matter how many times you drive down the road. Yeah. You can do it 20 times in one day, they'll still run at your car and wave and That's smile right. at you. Holidays, any holidays planned? Don't know yet. Yeah, so yeah, see what happens when we go back. Might go away, especially July. Kids have got the month off school, so yeah, go good time to there. party on. Party on, yeah. Throw the kids away somewhere and <laughs> go to Bali for four Bali. days. Bali. <laughs> go to Bali. Yeah, yeah. I might go just to annoy them. <laughs> just hang around, bring the kids. <laughs> uh, want to say hello to Pete? Say good day to Dale. Tell what I'm thinking of, and I'll see you later on. Yeah. Uh, what's the plans when you get back and? Leave it open? Yeah, no plans. It's a way to go. Hey Sarge, I know you wanna. You can read, read it all out. You what? Hello. G'day. Say hello to Mrs. Wanna go home really quick? Right now. <laughs> Had enough. Where, where you are you trying to say? To you don't like it over here no, anymore? <laughs> Bali as well. No, yeah. and my wife's not going to Bali. Is that right? That's correct. We're, we're, we've got the uh, husband's plan. We're, we're going over too and we're taking the kids. Just <laughs> and we're going to tag along wherever they go. Yeah. <laughs> Daily ritual feeding the fish. Commonly known as Free Aid Alpha. These, these little blokes come back from um, Dilly with us and they've been all over the countryside. They're the most travelled fish in Bloomin' Timor. And they started out the size of a minnow and now they're near on piranhas. Look at them. I think, if I remember right, Pete, there was about 20? Yes. Ah, 13. Oh, well, it's close. There was 13 when they started, and natural attrition, it's down to 5. We'll have a bit of a look down the top here. There they are. Ramey Engineering has made a swimming pool all full. That's for when it's, uh, the beach is closed. We go for a bit of a dip in the, uh, in the pool, have a bit of a close-up here. Oh, look at that. World Vision tarp. I wonder where they got that from. Anybody you want to say hello to back in Australia? Nah, nobody loves me. Uh, there's always someone, mate. What are you going to do when you get back? What's the plans? Go back to my unit, get out of the army, go to Europe. Europe? Whereabouts? France, Spain, Greece. Good world tour. Yep. Anybody you want to say hello to back in Australia? Nah, nobody loves me. Uh, there's always someone, mate. What are you going to do when you get back? What's the plans? Go back to my unit, get out of the army, go to Europe. Europe? Whereabouts? France, Spain, Greece. Good world tour. Yep. You loving it or what? Oh yeah, without a doubt. What are you doing? What are you? What's happening there? What's all this shit? Uh, we just had a CES check on the Tilly. Yep. And uh, we're just going. Through. Looking good. Yeah, got a few surplus tools. Oh, we're just uh, going through and uh, getting all the spare ones and palming them off to the other Tilly. No, oh, that's all right. Maybe. Every... Been stuck in the keystone. Yeah, really. Fair enough. Don't like it. No, it's not my job. No, oh, no. That's it. Being honest, that's the main thing. Say hello to. Well, unfortunately, I'm a sad individual that has no family members in Northern Territory or close by. Yeah. Just want to say hello in general. I'd like to say hello to all the families that are left in Darwin. Yeah. And uh, all the boys should be returning home soon and straight home to use. If uh, if they're not, then I'd be asking questions. Here we have the washing ladies. Say hello, ladies. Bondia. 
Good girls. They do our washing over there. Do a great job too. When they're finished, they bag it all up here on the uh, top of the water jerrys and the blokes come and pick it up. See, darling, oh, I take you Yeah, that's it, perfect. And, and the bike, the and wife the bike. and the bike, what more do you need? See, you told me I take, you know, where, but so far you've been at Epinara and Tennant Creek now over to East Timor. It's well travelled. Ida Balartan, Meliano, Bellabo. Where else do you bloody want to go? <laughs> He's over here, I've been enjoying his, uh, I've been a lot of the uh, local people, there's quite a few characters in that there. Yeah. What really, uh, the thing I'm sick of on my most is the uh, kids. Yeah. Here's not that for a second. I was bombing most of the kids. Like, uh, first few weeks we were here, when we were taking rubbish down the dump, you got the kids five, six, sometimes down to three, fighting over the rubbish to get food scraps and that. That's what really sort of hits home to people where they don't realise how well off all we have it in Australia. Yeah, dead right. And the yeah. kids sort of bitch and moan about um, eating their veggies and they want to come over here for a few weeks and see what it's like. Then you got some complaints. Yeah, throw a manky apple off the truck and all of a sudden yeah, they're fighting for it. Yeah. Exactly. And uh, so if my kids ever start bitching about having to eat food again, they're going to get slapped right upside the back of the head. <laughs> Bank on that, boys. Say hello on the video or what? Uh, hello? Who am I saying hello to? Oh, anybody back in Australia. It's a company video. Hello back in Australia. We just come back from right down on the border doing the hard yards for Delta Company who've uh, needed us to give them a hand. We're about to have a relax for the afternoon. All right. Hey, what about? Well, we were sort of asking a few standard questions. What's, what's the plans for when you get back? For the platoon or myself? No, yourself. Off oh, myself. Uh, Go head on. Head on to Geelong for a couple of weeks, and I've got to do my uh, M Rock course after that. So. Oh, yeah. Got any holidays busy. planned or? Uh, no, just going back to Geelong to relax back at home. Yeah, good. Back down Sounds in sunny right. Victoria. What's? It? So, I mean, is there any? Uh, any other pipe dreams after you all cashed up, ready to go? Or? Uh, no, pay off the credit cards. <laughs> <laughs> um, other than that, no, no real plans. Say hello to uh, back in Oz. Oh, I'd just like to say uh, good day to me three girls. Um, Jazz, good to see you uh, riding your push bike now. Uh, you can take Dad for a uh, spin around the paddock later. Serena, uh, good to hear you're enjoying school and you're doing well. And Nara, well up, only about two months to go. Doing a bit, so I'm looking forward to getting home and seeing you. Good. What, what's the plans? What plans you got for when you get back? Oh, let's see when I get back. I'm looking at uh, spending about a week of real details, I guess, and uh, then I'll take uh, Nara and my daughters away, maybe down to Alice Springs. Oh, that sounds uh, right. What about uh, what things have you enjoyed so far being in the team? Here? Um, I've enjoyed uh, the company. Okay, morale and uh, everything is really good here. Uh, they work well as a team. Uh, I think the biggest thing I'm going to remember when I leave here uh, will be the kids of Timor. Yeah, a number of people have said that with the uh, children, how happy they are. What about uh, sad or bad points? Is any you come across? Um, I think uh, some of the living conditions that these people are living in. Yeah. I think that's you know that's a bad point, but hopefully over time that'll be fixed. Yeah. Uh, but other than that, no, that's about it. No, that's not too bad. No, thanks a lot for that, sir. No worries. <laughs> Yeah, so here you go. <laughs> this is a Look at that. He's a wee bit camera shy. Look at that hair. He's got red. Look at that. Look at that haircut. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. We'll zoom on that haircut. This won't work. That so from... Tell them about Lieutenant Wynn making us put our toilet seats down. <laughs> okay, once again, the women have interfered in our male bastion world. One of the engineering officers is a female, and she came to give us a briefing on putting the toilet seats down when we were finished. <coughs> <laughs> to only have two minute showers and to realise that it takes 130 litres of water to do the washing. So once again, they've came in and uh, things are just like being at home. <laughs> That's great. I'm sure the 90% of women who will be watching this video will uh, enjoy that. Lizzie, this is not working. <laughs> yeah. Don't bring me on on this. <laughs> no, no, I don't want to be getting busted like this. What are you going to do when you get back, sir? What's the plan? What's first on the cards? What's the yeah. first thing you want to do? First thing I'll do when I get back? Yeah. Stay find his car. Oh, here, find my car. <laughs> and find all the other pieces of my furniture which are no longer in my house. Yeah. What about holidays? Any holidays planned or? Uh, operation. Uh, yeah. I'm coming back to Timor. Come back to Timor on holidays. <laughs> That's great. Lizzie. Mm -hmm. You gotta stop it. How do I stop it? You don't. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, we've got all that. <laughs> the XA is, this is uh, a normal day's work for the XA. Blame everything on Kluzy. Yeah, yeah. we're well, just seeing that printer. Yep, you ain't a pain. At, at the moment, the it's white. just pumped out about 80 pages of nothing. <laughs> what about, uh, <laughs> look at that. Big day's work. <laughs> what things, what things have you enjoyed here, sir? Look. Nothing, I want to go home. <laughs> what, things have been, what things have pissed you off then? <laughs> <laughs> this is Corporal. He's got a video camera. <laughs> and that's where it starts. Oh, he's a great bloke. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're kidding, aren't you? Get out of here. Yeah, so here you go. This is a big Look at that. He's a wee bit camera shy. Look at that hair. Look at that haircut. He's got red. Look at that. Look at the haircut. Look at that. Zoom on that haircut. This won't work. That so from tell them about Lieutenant Wynn making us put our toilet seats down. <laughs> okay, once again, the women have interfered in our male bastion world. One of the engineering officers is a female, and she came to give us a briefing on putting the toilet seats down when we are finished. <coughs> to only have two minutes showers, and to realise that it takes 130 litres of water to do the washing. So once again, they have came in, and uh, things are just like being at home. <laughs> That's great. I'm sure the 90% of women who will be watching this video will uh, enjoy that. Lizzie, this is not working. Yeah. Don't bring me on on this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be getting busted like this. What are you going to do when you get back, sir? What's the plan? What's first on the cards? What's the yeah. first thing you want to do? First thing I'll do when I get back? Yeah. Stay find his car. Oh, here, find my car. <laughs> find all the other pieces of my furniture which are no longer in my house. Yeah, what about holidays? Any holidays planned or? Uh, operation. Uh, yeah. Coming back to Timor. Come back to Timor on holidays. <laughs> That's great. Lucy, you better stop it. How do I stop it? You don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've got all that. <laughs> the XA is, this is uh, a normal day's work for the XA. Blame everything on Kluzy. Yeah, yeah. we're well, just seeing that printer. Yep, you ain't a pain. When they at at the moment, the it's white. just pumped out about 80 pages of nothing. <laughs> what about, uh, <laughs> look at that. Big day's work. <laughs> what things, what things have you enjoyed here, sir? Look. Nothing, I want to go home. <laughs> what, things have been, what things have pissed you off then? <laughs> This is Corporal. He's got a video camera. <laughs> and that's where it starts. Oh, he's a great bloke. <laughs> oh, you're kidding, aren't you? Get out of here. Are you? What's happening, mate? You going to say hello to the missus? Hello, missus? <laughs> <laughs> Your missus, you guess. Oh, my missus. Hello. <laughs> What's this for? Company video. Oh, you wanky. You should have told me. How are you going, Hov? Good. How are you? Good, mate. You're going to say hello to wife, are you? Hi, Tracy and Madeline. How are you, Dom? What's happening, mate? You, you enjoying it here or what? Um, I'd enjoy it more if I was at home with the wife and the daughter. That's, lov that's lovely, that's lovely, mate. What do you miss the most? Oh, I can't say that. <laughs> no, we got a fair idea. What comes second then? I um, miss my daughter the most. Yeah, yeah. Miss playing with her and talking to her. Oh, that's good. What's the? Uh, I won't say for your point of view. Oh, I will. What's the first thing on the cards for when you get home? Oh. I'll, the second thing I'll be doing is taking the boots off. Things have you liked that while being in Timor? Um, I like the um, the locals. They they're pretty good. Uh, surprisingly, they they're friendly and they're supr very surprisingly they're still real happy. Yeah. Happy that we're here and that. I suppose. What about uh, bad points? What things have uh, brought you down a bit? Um, oh, nothing about the place. Just being here in general. I'd rather be home. Yeah, yeah, long time away. Yeah, long What's the plans, mate, when you get back? What are you, uh, been a holidays yeah, planned? Yeah, holiday or? with the family, um, you, taking a break, a long break. Where are you going? Um, I haven't worked it out. I'll, I'll, I'll wait till I get home. Oh, I'll yeah. spend a couple, of, a couple, a week or two at home and I'll uh, work it out from there. Car? Oh, I've got some plans for the car. But Does the missus know? Um, no. <laughs> Jazz cleaning out the mozzie dome. Say hello to everybody back in Australia, mate. Hello, g'day. Miss you all. What a, what's, beautiful here. <laughs> what's the plans for when you get back, mate? Um, well, going uh, after two weeks in Darwin, going back to Brisbane, yep. waiting for my uh, uh, child's birth. Oh, good. And then having a couple of months off and 
Who knows what from there? Oh, that's all right. What are you, so, what are you hoping for, boy or, boy or girl? I'm hoping for a boy will give me less headaches oh. later on. <laughs> hey, oh, mate, I've got two girls, so you know, and they're, they're bloody cute, so God help me when I turn about 40. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what I'll other things, what? mate? What, what things have uh, impressed you while being over here? Um, actually, the morale of the blokes has yeah. been excellent. Teamwork is bloody excellent, no matter how bad things get. Yep. It's always good within the platoon section. Yep. Um, yeah, basically everyone's waiting to go home, but they won't let that get them down. So what about, still pull together. What about uh, things that have uh, stuck in your mind, like uh, any bad points that come to mind? Uh, I won't mention uh, any bad points on that, but uh, I mean, it's just amazing uh, the, the countryside, yeah. and, uh, especially populated areas, how this lot they are, and uh, how disorganised uh, the country virtually is, yeah, yes. and they're still struggling to get on their feet. There. You can see it developing now with their cornfields and everything like that. You, have you you've noticed any changes over the last couple of months? Oh, definitely. Since we've been here, the people have started going about their normal daily routines, and uh, they start to bring their own uh, um, properties back up to scratch to where they uh, look livable. Yeah. So it's yeah, been vast improvement from what has happened before. Okay, winding up. Is there any last things you want to say to anybody in particular back in uh, Australia? Uh, I just miss you all. <laughs> Good on you, mate. Take it easy. Buy and low for Sergeant Coombs. We finally got a fair idea where he is. Let's go have a look. Has anybody seen Sergeant Coombs? Yes. Ah, oh, here he is. <laughs> what's he doing here? Oh, yeah. Well, what's underneath? What's underneath your butt? That's what I'm wondering about. Where's the other book? What's it? Where's that stick book, Dad? Stick book. <laughs> <laughs> here he is. Uh, th this is the uh, mech sergeant. As you know, we've got vehicles broken down everywhere. <laughs> and here he is. Down this always. is Ramey off his ass. We've got the last one laying down spread eagle on his yep, bed. That's right. And he's both of them. I've actually got both of his laying down to him. Fuck all. <laughs> Finally got a picture of you working. I better I'll frame this. <laughs> this is. Oh, look at that. Hey, Simo. Can't look up, can't. I'm not looking up. <laughs> that's all. Right, turn it off in anyway. <laughs> so what core do you want to go to, Simo? Not VMs, mate. <laughs> Coming up to the uh, checkpoint out the front of our uh, company headquarters. Here's a couple of fellas working hard. Hey, how are you? G'day. <laughs> And this is it, the luxuries of life and teeing or tin roof, sandbags, K phone, a seat. What more do you want? Uh, what more do you want? For <laughs> 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 all Charlie Company rugby or beach rugby game. Semi tackle. There's a big hit there. 